Good afternoon, I'm Faye Barker. The SNP's Nicola Sturgeon says she plans to push for a second independence referendum as soon as possible, despite warnings it could end up in the courts. The Westminster government has so far rejected talk of uh, allowing another vote on the issue after pro-independence parties won a majority in the Scottish Parliament. This morning, Michael Gove said people expected politicians to focus on the coronavirus recovery, not the constitution. Katie Barnfield has the latest. Labour leader Sir Keir Starmer is carrying out a reshuffle of his shadow cabinet team after a lacklustre performance in the local elections. He is facing criticism from within the party for sacking his deputy, Angela Rayner, as Labour's chair and campaign's coordinator. Well, our political reporter, Shehab Khan, is with me now. So, some difficult times for the Labour leader at the moment. Yeah, and it, it looks like that. Oh, thank you, Shehab. An undercover investigation has claimed the Queen's cousin, Prince Michael of Kent, was willing to profit from his royal status by providing access to Russian President Vladimir Putin for a fee. Debris from a Chinese rocket that had been soaring back to Earth has been filmed disintegrating over the Indian Ocean. Finally, Edinburgh Zoo's welcomed nine new penguin chicks. It will have more in the evening news just before 6.30. Until then, have a good afternoon. Bye-bye.